Well, hello, 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 everyone out there in Tarot Land. This is your girl Zengaya, the Zen Libran, and welcome, welcome, welcome to my channel, Zen Libran Tarot. What's up, y'all? Peace, peace, peace out there to everybody. How you living? How you living? How you live? I hope everybody is living well, living swell. You know what I'm saying? My name is Swell, and I do it well. Yeah, I'm knowing about that. But, um, yeah, um, thank you for joining me, guys. You know what I'm saying? Here we are with another reading. If this is the first time that you join my channel, on my channel, I focus on women empowerment. I'm all about elevating the goddess back to her emperor status so that she can retake her throne and rule this earth as she was designed to. You know, the woman was designed, the earth is designed to be ruled by the matriarch. As a matter of fact, the matriarch is, when the matriarch ruled was the last golden age. Everything after that has been dismal. Look who's in charge, the patriarch. The woman rules with love. And the man, the man rules with death and destruction. You know? Um, so it's all about loving yourself, ladies, to get back on your throne. Because these men, um, the powers that be that run this earth, they would rather torch this earth up and put it in hell's fire in order for them to rather than relinquish the throne back over to you you know what I'm saying and they're ready to take you out you know what I'm saying so we have to protect ourselves at all the times we have to be ready so we don't have to get ready you know what I'm saying I mean it's all our battle you know what I'm saying um tell his oldest time beauty and the beast okay they beauty and the beast they made a cartoon off of it you know what I'm saying I mean it's just ridiculous you know what I'm saying but we ready for battle you know what I'm saying? And we trying to get other women ready. You know what I'm saying? Because this is our throne. And we are taking it back by any means necessary. Okay? Um, Mother Earth is awake. And it's time for us to take our uh, place, ladies. You know what I'm saying? It's time for us to do our thing. All right? All right. Well, I'm here for you today to do a general collective reading for the zodiac sign of Virgo for the month of January. Now, what's going on with my Virgo? My Virgo is having harvest season. This is your harvest season, Virgo. Yeah. And you in your Virgo mode. You know what I'm saying? Your Virgo, you know, them Virgos don't just sleep with everybody. You know what I'm saying? They keep them close, honey. They know they know how to um, be in hermit mode. They, they they stay to they self and they'll be fine. They don't give a damn. You know what I'm saying? They know how to keep them legs closed and keep their emotions to themselves. You know? And um, so um, this Virgo is going through a harvest season. You have somebody that is in fear. Uh, because of this, because you're not letting them, you're not being bothered with them. They can't come near you. You cut them completely out of your life and out of your energy. And this person is worried um, that he can't get next to you. Can't get next to you, babe. Can't get next to you. Hell no, you can't get next to me. Okay. And of course, this is the Goddess Channel. Like I tell you, this is all about the woman. Um, so I speak from the woman's aspect and I pull from the feminine energy and the feminine energy that I pulled um, to help me deliver this message for my Virgo is Mamba. No, I hate that light. Uh, it's a uh, Mama Jumbo. She's here giving us the energy of shine. You are in your boss energy. You know what I'm saying? You the goat. You know what I'm saying? Capricorn energy, you know what I'm saying? Boss energy. You shining out here, you know what I'm saying? And this particular person that is uh, upset that you won't let them get next to you is your twin flame. Mm -hmm. So this person is trying to sabotage you. Whatever you got that's shining, whatever you business you have that you the boss of, you know what I'm saying? He's trying to sabotage this because he don't want you to shine. If you're not going to be with me, you're not shining, bitch. That's what he's saying. This is a raggedy, envious, jealous ass man that's jealous of a woman and, and can't take rejection. But you better get your billy goat looking ass on. Don't nobody want you. This is Mama Jumbo giving us the energy of shine. You know, get your shine on, get your shine on. And he out here hating with his little glass. You know what I'm saying? There's always somebody ugly that's be hating. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you ain't got time for this. You know what I'm saying? Somebody is very uncomfortable, but do we do we give a damn? No. They uncomfortable, honey. They over there in their feelings. They crying and everything. They want to apologize. They want you to forgive them, you know, uh, right now. You know, right now in the prison, they trying to message you. You could have this person blocked 
from your social media, blocked from your phone. Um, they can't message you. They want to communicate with you, but you don't want nothing to do with them. And you're making this person very uncomfortable. You know what I'm saying? I mean, because this is a controlling ass person. He used to control everybody he's been with, but he's not with you. You know what I'm saying? So how he going to control you? And even if he was with you, he couldn't control you. You know, you're a divine feminine. What the hell? You know what I'm saying? This is a controlling ass person. And you didn't cut his ass off. I know that's right, girl. He's uncomfortable. He's uncomfortable. So, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> don't nobody give a damn about you. You don't matter. You don't nobody give a damn about you, bruh. You know what I'm saying? This feminine, she ain't no kid. She know what's up with you. This is a woman 40 years plus. This is a grown-ass woman. She's very wise. And she knows what's up with you. You know what I'm saying? She knows what's up with you in this current situation. She know what you want, dude. And she don't want you, okay? She's a wise woman. This ain't no little kid. Go play with them little girls. This is a grown-ass woman over here. You know what I'm saying? She's chosen. And look who's coming down. She's a watcher. That's what I'm saying. She's a watcher. Metatron. Metatron. The hidden veil. The on the throne. You know what I'm saying? This is the woman that they took out the throne, y'all. They made the woman the Holy Ghost. But that's not the Trinity that they give you, Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. That's the fake-ass Trinity. The Trinity is woman, Father, and Son. You know what I'm saying? Because it won't be no Father or no Son without no damn woman. You know what I'm saying? And Metatron is on the throne. You know what I'm saying? The head of the throne in heaven. You know what I'm saying? And she sends watchers to the earth to guide and counsel and lift his vibration. And she don't play about her watchers. You know what I'm saying? So she's on deck trying to see what this person is doing to her God. You know what I'm saying? This feminine has been empowered by Metatron. So, hey man, when Metatron come, it's hell to tell the captain. So if you want to go there, go there. Because I, I ain't nothing happening with Metatron. She'll tear your ass up. You hear me? You hear me? You know what I'm saying? She comes from Metatron House. She comes from that uh, bloodline. You know what I'm saying? This feminine is spiritually connected. Look at her. Look at her, y'all. Now, this masculine is triggered by this. He's triggered by this, and he's spying on He probably outside the house right now. You know what I'm saying? He's triggered because she has a spiritual connection. You know what I'm saying? He's trying to use a, a control tactic. Uh, his control tactic is passion. You know, he hopes to get her in bed. And if he gets you in bed, he's going to get you pregnant. This is what he's trying to do. A keeper, a keeper, trying to keep somebody. To trap somebody. So, don't deal with this masculine, okay? Don't deal with him. All right? <laughs> he crazy, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, honey, you've changed and you're free from this particular person. Yeah, you released this particular person and you're closed off against this person. You're guarding this person and you're rejecting this person. You're resisting this person. You don't want him, but he wants you to love him. Boy, don't nobody love you. Get your ass out of here. You know what I'm saying? Going on somewhere. You know what I'm saying? This feminine's life is taking a new direction. She's taking a new direction and I know you're so glad, honey. You know what I'm saying? Whatever you've been putting your time and energy into, whatever you've been investing on it, you get the return. You know what I'm saying? Um, you're having slow and steady progress, but now it's going to boom, and you're going to get a return on whatever it is you've been investing in. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. And it's going to warm your heart. It's going to warm your heart, honey. Um, you're going to have this type of breakthrough. I mean, Jupiter is around you, you know, and then, you know, Jupiter is luck and expansion. You're going to have a new beginning, honey. Things is going to take action for you very quickly in your life. And it's going to warm your heart, honey. I know that's right, girl. I know that's right. Let's get these tarot cards out here. Let's get these tarot cards out here. And let's see what the universe has to say about this whack-ass masculine that's trying to keep somebody by getting them pregnant. Please. That want to be in your life because you shining. You hear what I'm saying? With his billy goat looking ass. You know what I'm saying? This person is ready to surrender to the angel of truth. See, you're somebody that tells the truth. Of course, you come from Metatron's uh, bloodline. I mean, come on, man. You are a diamond in the rough. And you done found your true worth. And you know your true worth. And this person knows it. And he's ready to surrender to you. Because he knows you know he knows your true worth. You know what I'm saying? You could be um, very um, known on uh, social media. Yeah. This person wants you to drop your uh, guards. 
you know, um, he wants you to surrender with him, and he's been attacking you, giving you unnecessary drama because you don't want to be with him. What kind of dude is you? You can't make nobody be with you, bully somebody into being with you, and then you sitting up here attacking her? You think attacking somebody makes you be with them? You's a fool, you know what I'm saying? Who you been dealing with? Not no divine feminine, obviously. Yeah, this person loves you, and he's trying to contain you. You know what I'm saying? Like, hold you captive or something. You know what I'm saying? But you're not thinking about him. You done moved on to something big or something better. You ain't thinking about his ass, and he can't take it that you ain't thinking about his ass. But so what? Get your ugly ass on. He all ugly, you know what I'm saying? You don't even want him. You don't want nothing to do with this person. He going to bully you into being in a relationship with this Ichabod Crane looking ass. You know what I'm saying? He better get out of here. You know what I'm saying? Girl, I tell you, they just don't know what we go through doing that divine family. That's why I be telling them, bitch, you don't know my life. Bitch, you don't know my life. You know what I'm saying? Please. Just because we are the light and of the bloodline of Metatron don't mean we don't attract the darkness. You know what I'm saying? But we equipped to battle that darkness, you know what I'm saying, and, and overcome that, you know what I'm saying, so whatever you want to do, we prepared, we ready for it, you know what I'm saying, you don't want him, you don't want him, look at you with your beautiful self, beautiful, loving, caring, nurturing, could be psychic, very intuitive, good mother, good, um, great mate, you know what I'm saying, everything, I mean, you're the, you're the total package, you know what I'm saying, you, you're, true, you're, you're truly worthy, you know what I'm saying, and that's why he trying to get with you, girl. Mm-hmm. What we got out here, y'all? What we got out here? Yeah. Yeah, this person tried to defeat you, you know, but he couldn't. Um, this particular person is in regret that he put you you guys' love connection on the back burner and was out here in the streets having threesomes and group sex and swinging and stuff and left y'all on the back burner. Now he's focused on y'all connection. He wants to reconcile. Is he crazy? You know what I'm saying? This person is not husband material. He's not a boyfriend material. He's not even friend material. You know what I'm saying? And he wants you to come back to him because your finances are taken off. But you are resisting this person. You don't want nothing to do with him, but he has his focus on you, though. Yeah, this person is very immature, very immature. Um, he don't have much to offer you. You know what I'm saying? He don't, he's not offering you much. All he's offering is his penis. You know what I'm saying? I mean, ain't no love or nothing here. You know what I'm saying? He just want to sit up and hump on you all night long. You know what I'm saying? But you're rejecting his ass. You don't want nothing to do with him. You know what I'm saying? I mean, as far as he's concerned, you are his wish fulfillment. You know, you are a star, and that's why this person wants to control you with, uh, he wants to control your kitty cat. That's what he wants to control. He don't want nobody else to have it because he knows you're a holy grail. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Um, he mad as hell. He's mad as hell because he's been uh, sending all type of sexual energy towards you, and you're not paying attention to him. He's doing this to get you into a relationship with him, but... You know, you're not thinking about his ass, and he knows it too. He knows, and he's sitting down because the battle is over, and he's like, I didn't win. No, you didn't win, bruh. And he's mad as hell. He's trying to control you with sex so that you can come back to him because he's in regret that he let you get away. He's mad because you're a star. You know what I'm saying? And he gave you this little offer, and you're not, you don't want to be with him. You don't want to be in no commitment with him. So he tried to attack you. You know what I'm saying? But he couldn't defeat you because you from the bloodline of Metatron, dog. You, you, you got me twisted. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you, 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 you got me twisted. You're not going to make her do a damn thing. I mean, what's wrong with this dude? You know what I'm saying? Something wrong with him, y'all. Something is definitely wrong with this dude. Let's get some more energy out here before I close this up. He done had lost his mind, honey. Because you don't want him. He's attacking you because you won't have sex with him because he feels he can control you through sex. But everything is going to change. Um, you're going to have a lot of growth in your life. Um, everything in your life is going through a transformation, and this person is not included. Okay? Go on on somewhere, man. Metatron ain't going to get your ass. You know what I'm saying? Go on on. Yeah, go on on. Mm-hmm. We got five, five, five here. Mm-hmm. No, it's just five fifty-five. So that's change and growth and 
you know, that's a transformation. You know what I'm saying? He's trying to transform this connection. Boy, go on. Nobody trying to, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You adjudication. This, this connection is in spiritual court. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? And the divine is going to let her divorce your ass. You know what I'm saying? Because you ain't know nothing. You know what I'm saying? This is a spiritual court. This is supposed to have been a spiritual connection, but he decided to be out in the street with these Jezebels and succubuses and stuff. You know what I'm saying? And you went your own way. You moved on. You know what I'm saying? And now he's trying to plead his case in court. And the divine looking at him like, when you with other women, didn't you leave her by herself? What do you expect for her to do? Get out of my courtroom. Contract is uh, re you're released from this contract. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was supposed to get married or something like that. You know what I'm saying? But um, it ain't happening. You know what I'm saying? Because he chose to be in other relationships. You know what I'm saying? This person is not husband material. This is a person that thinks is only thinking about money. Um, very nasty, very think that he's better than everybody else. You know what I'm saying? He's not a good father. He can't run no business correctly. He's just an asshole and, and he wants you to come back to him. Boy, psh, come back to what? Ain't nothing to come back to. He wants you to come back to him so he can end this poverty. This food going through poverty. And I told you he wants you to come back to him because your finances are taking off and he's only concerned about money. That's why he got you on his mind. Please, you know what I'm saying? Trying to send you a message, boy. Get your ugly ass on out of here, dope thing. You know what I'm saying? He don't even have much to offer you, and he's immature, and he just want to screw you, boy. Please, please, yeah. This is a thief, girl. He just trying to steal your energy. He just trying to steal your steal your energy. So keep rejecting his dumb, stupid ass. You know what I'm saying? Don't nobody want you, bruh. You better go over there and stay with them McCormick's you with. This is a false person. This is just the boy ain't on nothing. He just trying to siphon your energy. Girl, boy, get on. Your life taking a new direction. Oof. This person has a stench on him. Don't nobody want you, man. Damn. With your worst of ass. Yeah, get your ass on. This cycle has ended and you going on a new journey in life. You know what I'm saying? You a star. You know what I'm saying? This person want to kind of try to control what's between your legs. Who the hell are you? Don't nobody control that but her. Her glass. Girl, I can't stand him. You know what I'm saying? Steady trying to uh, call you from fake numbers because you got his number blocked. Boy, get on. Trying to get around the block. If somebody got you blocked, they don't want to talk to you, dog. Is you something wrong with you or something? This person has a mental problem. You know what I'm saying? And thinking that he can uh, get you to have sex with him and it's over. Boy, don't nobody want your raggedy. Ugh. Don't nobody want you on. Ugh. Go away. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, he working hard, too. He working hard spiritually. Doing his spell work. Throwing all type of sexual energy your way so you could be like, hey, what's going on? You know what I'm saying? Come give it to me, daddy. Boy, get your ass on out of here, man. It's ridiculous ridiculous y'all you know what i'm saying and this is all about what you're receiving this great fortune this is all about this and he think he uh has a right to partake in this no you don't you need to partake in some penicillin with your nasty ass okay well this is what i have for my virgos y'all if you feel anybody could benefit from this please 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 Share the consciousness, share the awareness, honey. Whatever occupation you have is going to send you on a new journey in life. And this person tried to steal this from you. This person wanted you to be impoverished. You know what I'm saying? And now the divine, um, y'all in spiritual court and the divine is ruling in your favor. You are here shining. You're free from this particular person. And he just going to have to deal with it. Your life is taking a new direction. So he needs to take a new direction. You know what I'm saying? You're keeping your legs closed to him. You're in your Virgo energy. And this is making this person uncomfortable. But do we give a damn uh, a no? You know what I'm saying? So go on, on with your life, Divine Feminine. Leave this fool in the past. You know what I'm saying? A fool is a fool is a fool. Ignore, ignore, ignore. Okay? All right. Well, guys, um, i see y'all again for my next reading. You know I love y'all. And as I always, any ladies, please. 
Know thyself. Know thyself. Know thyself. I'll see you guys on the next read. Y'all be easy. Bye-bye.